I am. Hi, Muse. Hello. So we got Nindic and Bard playing now. I've been playing a little bit more since Simon and Richter, just kind of like casually, and he has some cool stuff. Yeah, they, I mean, they have some interesting stuff. It's just like, the issue with this is going to be just how mobile Zero Suit is. She's kind of able to just weave in and out of a lot of the setup stuff that uh, the Belmonts want to get going. Yeah, I feel like there's a couple of key moves that really help in matchups of Rushdown style characters that uh, Simon and Richter could definitely utilize. I think Nuchiller is definitely one of those. Um, but... The issue there is, though, that just like Zero Suit has so much range on her moves that she can kind of just outrange Nuchiller. Well, it's more like, in my eyes, it's a way to punish, you know, spacing errors. Okay, that's fair, yeah. It's, it's not something that you can just go to and spam and things like that. But it's def it's an option. You have to look at, like, you know, options in uh, different scenarios. Like, that was actually, I guess, either an execution error or a, uh, or maybe not an execution error, but, like, are you talking about just, the Zare to like, Fair? Well, just getting hit by the axe is like... Oh, yeah. That's just kind of yeah. like... And sometimes it's worth the trade uh, against yeah, low Simon. Percent. Because, like, just take the hit, get him off stage, and then go for an edge guard, and you can kill him at low percents. Absolutely. Ooh, yeah, that was sick. That was nice. But, yeah, like, getting hit by the axe at low percents really isn't that big of a deal. And, yeah, this is kind of, like where the Belmonts really struggle in this matchup. Now he's got him in a good spot, but like whenever Zero Suit's able to just jump around and do all her stuff, it can be kind of, you just get this going. Like she just gets her hit and she just gets so much damage. Is he dead? Sick. Yep. Oh my God. That was dope. That wasn't quite the DI you want. I feel like down and in would have been. Down and away right down there away would be on best. And then like at, after a while, like once you're out of hit stun, you just start holding in so you don't like. Die out to the side. Yeah, yeah. Oh, rolled in and got the dash attack. Yeah. Ooh, sick. You gotta watch out for the axe up there. It's very active and very strong. Do you know if uh, the Belmonts have an option to do, like, the uh, kind of the instant ledge grab to Trump kind of thing? Is that an option with that character? I don't actually know. If nothing else, I feel like threatening that as an option, too, is really good for the character. Yeah, that could be. But I've never seen it, but I'm not entirely sure. It could be a thing. Down tilt jab, just getting the pressure there. I like his 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 use of down tilt's been really good from Bard. I like that. Yeah, that's a that's a really good tool versus the like kind of zone breaker characters that can just they can contest a range that he's not very comfortable with. You can just do that down tilt and get a really good burst option to get in and get a little bit of damage, get him towards the corner. Ooh, that was a really good patience, I like that. Uh-oh, that'll do it. Oh, uh, that should be stock and game one. I'm guessing he was trying to parry the Paralyzer and just drop shield a tad bit early. Yeah, that's Because he, like. he was holding shield for it. What's up? You won 2-0? Okay, thank you. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, no, if he charges it, it goes really far. <laughs> All right, so Armadillo 2-0. All right, we got the Battlefield uh, Dracula's Castle. I respect it. Getting the home field advantage. I'm kind of sad they didn't strike to music on that one. <laughs> like, that's there's some good. There's some good so tunes. So good. Yeah. There's such good tunes in it. All right, so getting into game two. I think that uh, like Bard could be looking to get a bit more of that down tilt type stuff going because that was always that's always a really good option and it seems like that was a lot of the ways he was able to get stuff going in general which is to get that down tilt and try to like push zero suit to the corner oh uh, yeah that uncharged paralyzer is just so bad now like you actually just don't get anything off of it uh oh getting the Ooh, up air the strings ladders, yeah good patience on that too yeah he called out the air dodge and that's 72%. That's nothing to sneeze at. Ooh, you think he caught his jump. Yep. Oh, that's unfortunate. Tried to, yeah, he tried to get to ledge, but just a slight bit off. Ooh, good forward air there. I didn't realize you have to time it as much like that when you're, like, horizontal with ledge or just above it, even. I think it's because their... CSS air, was there, too. <laughs> well, that, and then also, like, 
the Belmonts have really, really bad air drift. Oh, it's terrible. So, like, that's, like, they, he kind of just wasn't able to get as far as he needed to. Like, I think they have the worst in the game. I'm not I, sure. I, it's it's after down play, there. After oh, playing, he doesn't oh have a my god, that he's be dead. It. Yep. He died at 69. That's really unfortunate. He had the power up, but not enough to get back on stage. And he, that's, didn't, he didn't have a uh, pigment on him. <laughs> That's what you really have to watch out for is Belmont, is you really have to save that jump. That's vital to your ability to come back, especially versus a character that has as much mobility and ability to edge guard as Zero Suit. Zero Suit in this game feels like Sheik in the old game. Like how far Zero Suit goes out oh, for yeah. an edge guard. Like, yeah, it's definitely in, similar. In, ooh, sick. Uh, in theory, you know, Sheik still has that, but Sheik doesn't have another <laughs> option to kill. Like, yeah, yeah, that's what she just has to do. Oh, getting some good go. damage in there. Damage. Uh, I think he missed his wave bounce there. Cool, thank you. Alright, so he's mounting a bit of a comeback here. That's good, that's good. He's got, oh, Ooh. he caught the, caught the flip. That one's kind of hard because there's a lot of intangibility. Yeah, on it has so much invincibility now. Okay, getting that jab. Alright, he's gotta be really careful here. That was uh, do it. Yeah, that was where you're talking just need to be careful. <laughs> yeah, you have to kinda like max space that so you can just instant snap. And there's a lot of characters that just have that as a uh, kind of what's the liability if you yeah. will.